Hello. This is Dr. David Firth, Professor of Management Information Systems at the University of Montana School of Business. What I'm going to do first is just walk through a little bit of my background, and that way you can understand a little bit about who I am and why I'm teaching this class. So, I have a undergraduate and master's degrees from the University of Oxford in England. Those were both in physics, and after I completed those, I decided I'd move to this location. Take a second, figure out where that might be. Just give you a little heads up that it is not in the United States. And indeed it is London, England. So I am British, I'm not Australian, I'm not New Zealand, I'm not South African, I'm British. And so I went to work for Ernst & Young, which is one of the big four global audit consulting and tax firms. And I was in audit in London. And on the right of this picture, you can see there is a dealing room and I audited global uh, trading floors and derivatives. Really exciting time, I have to say, back in 1988 through 2002, 2003. Part of my reason for joining Ernst & Young was to get on the international exchange scheme. Uh, but before I could do that, I had to become, or I became, a chartered accountant. So the chartered accountant is the English equivalent of the American CPA qualification, the big difference being that to be an English chartered accountant, you have to take 15 exams, and to be an American CPA, you only have to take four exams. So at least we in England think ours is way more rigorous and thorough. So I got my chartered accounting qualifications, which I still hold, and then I moved to this location. Now this is in the United States, and give you a quick second to maybe guess where that might be. And that is Dallas, Texas. And this picture here is about as good a picture as you'll ever see of Dallas, Texas. Uh, right after a rainstorm, so all the trash is being washed away from the spillway. Uh, it's dark, so you just don't see how ugly Dallas is. I lived in Dallas for a year and, year and a quarter, and I like to say it's a year and, a year and a quarter too long. I did audit with Ernst & Young, and then I transferred from Dallas and Ernst & Young to this location here, which I'm sure you all know exactly where this is. This is San Francisco. And I joined KPMG, and I did transfer as an audit manager, but after being an audit manager, I moved into their information systems consulting practice. Um, and my main clients were Visa and Wells Fargo. And I finished up uh, with KPMG as a managing director. So I managed a lot of the operations there and I managed getting a lot of, did a lot of the recruiting and a lot of the training for new people to become consultants within KPMG's uh, information systems consulting practice. After KPMG, I went here, which as you can see from the picture is UCLA. And I took five years and got my management information systems degree from the Anderson Graduate School of Management at UCLA, which is one of the top 10 business schools in the world. And then I came to this location, University of Montana, and I've been here 13, 14 years now. My term at the University of Montana, I've been an information systems professor the whole time. And what I also do, though, is a little bit of consulting. And one of my main uh, companies that I consult with and help with as their business process manager is Be Alert Technology. And one of the big things we do for these guys, uh, one of the big things they do is they train bees to find landmines. And we can also try train bees to find suicide bombers. And so very interesting company to work with. Also worked with these guys on finding out and figuring out what killed all the nation's bees. It's called Colony Collapse Disorder. And we working with the army on this sort of project uh, figured out that it was a brand new virus and a nosema that attacked the bees. So we were able to figure out what was killing the nation's bees, which is a really interesting project. I still work with this company. We've got some really exciting things coming out soon with them, all based on technology. I also worked for this uh, company, or continue to work actually for this company. This is America's Professor. This picture here is of Jack Morton. Uh, he's a retired a business school professor of law. Currently, he is the CEO of America's Professor. And what I did for this company was I worked to select the online platform. So the entire platform and the business processes for America's Professor was picked and designed by me. 
and um, the platform we picked was Moodle. And the reason we have Moodle here at the University of Montana is the University of Montana approached me um, about picking a new platform for the university and I told them what a great experience we'd had working with Moodle and Moodle Rooms, which was the systems integrator. So the University of Montana went with Moodle and used Moodle Rooms as well. So I apologize, but the reason we have Moodle is me. Then also for a little while I did this company, uh, Pet Living Wills, peace of mind for pet lovers. And this was a completely online business. Three professors here at the University of Montana built this. Uh, our programmer lived in Salt Lake City. Our 1 800 call in number was in New Jersey. Our servers were somewhere in Texas. Completely online business. Um, problematic, we, we, we launched this at the worst month in uh, entire human history for starting a business, which was October 2008. That's when the global financial crash started. And so, this is not a going concern. We actually closed the doors fairly quickly because it was just an awful time to launch a business. What I bring all these up for is to show you that um, I've done this for real. I was a managing director of an information systems firm in San Francisco. and I've been working in the information systems field outside the University of Montana ever since. So I hope those pieces kind of tell you a little bit about my background and why I think you're going to find this a very interesting course.